What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Hello YouTube, what is up? Welcome back to another video. Today, I just want to basically tell you a story that happened to me in the past week. Right, okay, so last week I received an email that looked something like this. In this email, uh, it's basically just saying how I'm entitled to tax refund from my previous job when I worked at Car Factory. Um, yeah, uh, so it looked completely leg legitimate, because it was from HM Revenue or whatever you call it, and uh, so I clicked on the link, they told me how much, like, um, how much they can give me, it was like 650 or something, and then I clicked on another link, and that took me to a government gateway where they're like, you have to create an account. So I thought it was completely legit because it looked exactly the same as the normal website. The URL looked so, I don't know, maybe it was like one dot off or something, but it looked legit to me. So I filled out the, my information thinking, oh great, I'm going to get my money, you know. They said it might take a couple of days, so I thought, great, that's fine, whatever. A couple of days later, well a week later, I still hadn't got my money. You know, I was... I was getting quite just, come on now, give me my money, this is just getting silly now. So I call up my bank, I call up my bank and uh, it goes something, something like this. Hello. Oh hi, um, I'm just calling up about my bank, uh, just making sure everything's alright. Excuse what? Yes, um, it's, it's happened in the last 24 hours. They've completely cleaned you out. Right, right, thank you. Um, bye. Bye-bye. Completely cleared me out. Yeah, um, that, that's, that's, that's the way it went. Uh, not exactly the news I want to hear. But yeah, basically it was a fake email, they took me to a fake website, they just took my details, my card details, and bought a bunch of stuff with it, completely cleared out my bank account, and I'm not going to lie, that made me, that did make me want to do this. Uh... So yeah, I don't have a card now, so, so that's pretty dumb, but uh, the woman, the lady on the phone, okay, she told me what they had been buying with my card, and it's, it surprised me, I'm not going to lie, it did surprise me, it wasn't rations, it wasn't food for their, for their dying children, no, it was a month subscription to TV, no, to Now TV, it was a subscription to Netflix, I don't know why you need them both. What kind of sad, sad idiot is but paying for this? What else did they buy? Oh, £70 went towards a toll bridge charge. Like, they got feed for something. Or, oh, God, I don't even know. It was just stupid. Oh. The woman on the phone said, hopefully, uh, if the investigation people can give me my money back, they will. But I don't know. I haven't got my hopes on it. Yeah, it's just a bit of a bummer, really. Uh, basically, be careful, don't get scammed. It happens more than you think. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. I remember you.